And uh, I'm Jane Fonda, and I'm I was invited here. It's important to know I was invited here by my friends, Ojibwe and Anishinaabe friends, Winona and Tara, to stand with them and try to call attention to what is being done by Enbridge. This is a crime to be bringing tar sands oil, the most dangerous, polluting, greenhouse gas producing oil, that when it leaks, because it's so heavy, it sinks. It's very, very hard to clean up. This is just as bad as Keystone XL. To be bringing oil from Canada that will eventually go under 200 bodies of water, including the headwaters of the Mississippi, to be taken to the Gulf of Mexico and exported. We're allowing a foreign oil company to bring the most poisonous oil across this sacred land and across our country to be exported at a time when science is saying we are confronting an existential climate crisis. We have very little time. We have 10 years, the science says, to cut our fossil fuel emissions in half. Oh my God. We absolutely must keep warming at one and a half degrees Celsius. If it goes beyond that, there will be a domino effect. We pass a tipping point beyond which we lose control of everything. So from a global climate crisis perspective, this is criminal. From a tribal justice, tribal rights point of view, this is criminal. We understand that the fossil fuel industry has unionized jobs, good family supporting, career building jobs, and that is important. And we all understand why the fossil fuel workers are very scared and hostile to the idea that we're calling for the phasing out of fossil fuels. But we want to also say that we are fighting and pressuring the Biden administration that as he closes these pipelines, he will create what's called a fair transition to make sure that the workers are immediately transitioned to union jobs. It's not their fault that we're facing a climate crisis. The oil that has to be kept in the ground is called stranded assets. We can't allow the workers to be stranded assets. Mm -hmm. We have to thank them for doing dangerous and dirty work that helped build the country, but now it's over. That yes. time is over. But what is Enbridge doing besides damaging our globe and our tribal lands and the, the, the atmosphere. 